it's not going well. If I'm gonna be honest, it is not going well. I was supposed to get married like a couple months ago, but then planning got so like out of hand and we were gonna do this huge wedding. And I realized, oh my gosh, this is really expensive. So I was like, what if I get, what if we buy a house instead with the money and then do like an intimate, like smaller, like backyard wedding. Now, while they haven't decided on a date, there's one thing Lana knows for sure, that their dogs, Emmy and Timmy, will definitely be part of the big day. I really would love for them to be the ring bearer and the flower girl. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give my brother, like, a steak, and then, like, when it's time for my dogs to walk down the aisle, I'll have him, like, pull out the pocket steak and, like, come on. I just feel bad for my brother that he's gonna have, like, a bloody steak in his tux. All jokes aside, when it comes time for her moment to walk down the aisle, Lana assured us she found the perfect dress designed by Vera Wang. I very much wanted to feel myself in it. I'm in a very, very fortunate and lucky position where I get to wear really beautiful gowns, like, you know, for my job. And so I really wanted it to feel wedding. I wanted to feel like I could not wear this anywhere else but my wedding. I just want to be Ruby Gilman, normal teenager. In her new animated movie, Lana plays high school student turned all-powerful squid Ruby, and Lana told us Ruby reminds her a lot of her younger self. When we first meet Ruby, when she's like, uh, nervous and a rambler and like quirky and like awkward. I am that, but I was even more so that when I was in high school. I was very much trying to always fit in. So it was kind of fun to like, kind of do a little bit of like a baby Lana.